Hey there, everyone. This is Owl Cow interloping with Black Mesa. Here's a big weird alien construct. Don't worry about it. <laughs> There's like an elevator here. Yeah, that's right. I press a button. Yeah, so uh, we got ourselves a pretty climactic looking building here. I guess you'll want me to go on one of the pistons, uh, because, you know, that's rational. Yeah, that's right. Need this big machine to contain this wacky portal. And, uh, we're gonna go on it. Then let's see what happens. Uh, yeah. Here I am. This looks beautiful. He's the last. 666. There's the portal at the top of the tower that I've been looking at. Yeah, we weren't that all this time. Uh, and I guess this is where we're going. I don't know what's up with the blowers. Oh shoot, I thought I had missed my jump. That would have been sad. Uh, like, I'm just imagining the playthrough that's me, all the victorious run up to now. But then Gordon just missteps there and falls. Uh, yeah, what is up with a burner? Just burning power for the sake of it, huh? Oh, look at that portal. Look at everything here. This looks so cool. Oh, man. Whoa. Playing with visual weirdness. I'm ruining. I'm ruining the moment. Oh, we're getting close enough to get Nora here. I mean, we should just go. Whoa, here we go! Everything is white. Everything is wacky sounds. And then a big loading sticker was applied to the screen. Oh, jeez. Whoa, my stuff! No, 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 no. I still have. Hi. Hey. Oh. Nihilant is a big baby! Okay, so I see what was... Oh, I don't have a... Uh, do I have green crystals here that I can use? So, like, you got your safety shield in there. And your little thing. Okay, maybe I need to, like, explore around a little bit in this big room. Because right now, yeah, mm-hmm. Oh, big laser here. All right. So that's okay. No, that's your attack. Oh, jeez. I, yeah. He's chuckling. He's a chuckler. Cause like you got your shield there. Oh boy. Okay. Here we got dots. I don't want dots. Uh, let's see here. There's something teal and blue here. Chuckling mockingly. That's rude. Okay, so I can always heal. Good to know. But like, how do I get to you? Can I do that? Is that having an effect? Like, I'm seeing all of these, like, crystals things, you know? Like, something's happening. Uh, it's still working, though. Yeah, like, the thing is- Okay, 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 so that is the right thing to do. Cool. Okay, that is nice. That feels great. The issue is that I'm out of weapons to do that with. I need a green crystal to power up my, uh, my everything, right? Because I don't think that's gonna do it. I mean, it might, but... I don't think it will. I mean, I got bees. This is gonna be a bee fight. Yeah, see, I'm not getting any feedback. Okay, is this, this is shielding crystals. Okay, so my hope is that one of the background thing is uh, something for my weaponry. Right now, I'm mostly just kind of dancing around. <laughs> It can be confused for a fight, I guess. It's just not doing it, right? Like, I need... 
Okay, maybe I need to step into the green. Maybe that's gonna recharge my... What's that? I don't know. Alright, let's go in the green. Is that a fat... Nope, that just hurts me. That just hurts me. It did not recharge my radiation weapons. Alright. Oh, I'm so slow. I just feel so slow. Um, I could run. I could do that. Okay. How do I get in there? Well, yeah, you can hurt me all you want, but I'm invincible in this pool. And I'm no I don't think you realize that. How do I get my whoa, what's that? We got friends in the in the walls. Oh boy. Oh cool, wait, this appeared here. Nice! Okay. Uh I could well you know what? One way or the other, right? So we paint this. Thank you, Lambda! This would not be possible without you. Okay, so. Uh, that was loud and uh, good. Uh, oh, that's a rock heading right at me. Whoa, one single missile? You know what? Super laser's pretty good, but... Okay, did that get to you? I don't know if it did. Wait, I still... I got hurt a lot. Okay. Okay, I need to go heal again. Man, Nail Ant really is loud, though. He has things to say. So there's green things all over the place. I don't know if that's something I want to interact with, but I seem to be kind of walled in here. Uh, like, what is up with those green things? Uh, green things, the clock. Like, I would love to... What is happening? Is that like a portal of some kind that he made? I don't know. All right, let's he hang out here for a little bit. Like, what is that green thing? Is that something I can do something about with? Okay, so they can be destroyed while I hang out in the healing juices. Uh, okay. So that was probably a good... Um, now we got these things just kind of hanging out everywhere. Oh, what? They're like chunks of home? Okay, I don't know why this is, but I appreciate it. Alright, you. Did that do anything? I think, yeah, it did. It totally did. It has, like, opening now. Okay, 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 okay. Got it. Yeah, see, there's an opening in his big shield. So I can just shoot like a missile in his stupid face. Ah, I don't know why he teleported. Oh, no, maybe it was Lambda that teleported a piece of home here. That would be really funny. And appreciated. Now, I don't know if there's a thing there, but I can just get rid of this. It's all good. It, whoa! Something just landed on my head. Alright, I need to go heal. Can I do it in time? Yes, absolutely. I can totally make it here in time. Can I can like pose from here though. So you know what? Let's do that. Let's just let the hose flow from the safety of the kiddie pool. Also, I can throw missiles from the safety of the kiddie pool. Like that would be the smart thing to do. But he's mocking me, shockingly. All right, I feel like this is... Well, you know what? If I can destroy more of his big glass shield, you know? It's not a bad thing. I think. I think it's not a bad thing. All right. I mean, I am hitting... Uh, shoot, I pressed the wrong button there. All right, buddy. Yeah. Here comes the hose. Do you think you'll be affected by his bees? Well, I don't know if it's his bees. Alright, I need... Okay, I got more stuff there. Okay, I got a bit more of this I can use. 
But like, there's another lab uh, that fell somewhere, right? So that I can probably use? Yeah, shoot when the thing- Oh, jeez. I just- Whoa, I got- I got rocked. Yeah, beep, beep indeed. Accurate. Yeah, I was at a different lab, I think. Oh, jeez. Can I make it in time? Can I make it to the pool in time? I just need to seek medical attention in the swimming pool. Okay. Like, does that make sense to do? What was that? Oh, and then I did die in the swimming pool, which is... Okay, so we re resume here at the green stub zone. Got it. So yeah, that's a piece of lab. Uh, and I can free it. And then I have access to it. That is super weird and I love it. And there's another one way in the back. So I think that the correct way to do this is probably to run a whole lot more than I was. Oh boy. Uh... Oh boy, that was bad. Uh, is there health here? Nope. Looks like there's health here though. If I can make it there in time. So like, I'm not invincible while I'm in the pool. Just nearly so. So now we're here. Big baby's throwing a big tantrum. Just gonna go right on the fire, apparently. That's the kind of thing I'm into. So I don't know if I'm doing better. Uh, buddy, get down, thank you. Okay, right in the stupid face. That's what we want. Safe behind a rock. Huh? Oh, yeah, 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 no. This is the gun to use. I'm just melting through a shield right now, and that was very pretty. I love it. But, you know, we can get some more human activity. Like, do I want to hit his face or, like, the... The computer parts. He's mocking me, by the way. Very mean. Please stop being mean. Yeah. Big stones. Like, oh, there's a truck you're throwing at me. It's an earth truck. You did that. You were like, you know what? I got this truck. I'm gonna throw it at this man. Seems like a good idea. Cool idea. Right? I mean, it's pretty neat, to be fair. Yeah, his shield, like, kind of comes back or, or not. Maybe it's because I was at the wrong space at the wrong time. Because here he's just, like, completely exposed. Uh, I'm spraying him and I'm hosing him down and, like, I'm not getting a whole lot of feedback. Alright, I need to... Okay, there's a station... Oh, am I supposed to hit these? That's why he's mocking, maybe. Like, you're supposed to, like, get him to get those out and then destroy those? Hey, that's cheating. You can't just make a spire appear exactly where I'm attacking. That is an... Oh, boy. Yeah, truck on my way. Okay. Um... Alright, what's my weapon situation right now? Not doing great. Uh, yeah, but da, da, da. I like that sound. Come on, buddy. Okay, so these. Yeah, there we go. He hates that. Okay, got it. So hurt him enough to make him summon his healing spires. And then, whoa, insult his mother, I don't know. Okay, there's gonna be stuff here. Ah, shoot. What's that gonna do? 
Yes, okay. I was a bit worried that I would have missed. But I did it. So, that's good. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. I'm not saying a whole lot. I realize that. I'm mostly uh, kind of busy with what's going on. Okay, you're gonna summon this friend. No friends for you. Oh, jeez. Pain sound. Oh, yeah, you got nothing. You got a missile in your face. How about that? Okay, well, you're warping reality as I know it. That's probably bad. Uh, can I move? I can move. Oh, boy. Okay. All right, just wild and wacky world of stuff going on here. Big laser, big fire, and a big blue circle for me. I think that's a shield. Okay, there's a capsule here in the back. Help me out. Oh boy, great, a grenade. That's gonna be useful. Oh wow, uh, so space itself is kind of forgetting to exist at this point. It's pretty cool. Okay, another capsule here. You guys should run. Yeah, you're not. Oh, cool. Okay. I don't know what. what whoa. Yeah, you're putting up a shield, which is pretty much cheating. No shields, okay? I put out. Oh, wow, my health is like completely gone. Alright then. Health here a little bit. Uh, oh, you got something in your head, friend. Uh, I don't think your crystal brain should be exposed. Uh, but I'm not a professional. Uh, I'm not holding any weapons anymore. Also, I'm being attracted towards you. Help! <laughs> Screaming back! <laughs> Screaming back? Those are the sounds you expect to hear when God dies. Oh boy. Hey, I'm outside. I am unweaponed. From far away! In case you didn't realize that. Whoa! <laughs> it's a double sided atomic. Mu Everything is gray. Gordon Freeman in the flesh. Stop. Rather, in the hazard oh. suit, I took the liberty of You're pretty funny. leaving you of your weapons. Still got my hands, Most you know. Most of them were government property. Ah, uh, you're not wrong. As for the suit... Yours? I think you've earned it. The border world, Zen, is in our control. For the time being, thanks to you. Quite a nasty piece of work you managed you are over there. Way too detailed. I am impressed. That's why I'm here, Mr. Freeman. I have recommended your services to my employers, and they have authorized me to offer you. A job. Wait, so you knew that mild with me scientist have limitless potential. John Freedom is a complete menace to all his surroundings? You proved yourself a decisive man. The universe knows this? So I don't expect you'll have any trouble deciding what to do. If you're interested, just step into the portal and I will take that as a yes. Wipes label audibly Otherwise, is pretty funny. No. I can offer you a battle you have no chance of winning. Rather an anti-climax after what you've just survived. I mean, I either step in this Time portal... To choose. Or I'm just kind of chilling in this tramway for the rest of eternity, huh? I cannot even zoom. It's time to choose. Ah, fine, whatever. I'm done with you. <sighs> Wisely done, Mr. Freeman. I will see you. No way, yeah. The portal, his portal, is not getting away from him, you idiot. 
I'm hired! Man, that was a hell of a job interview. Black Mesa screening process is kinda ridiculous, but... I mean, I've heard that, uh, you know, the benefits are worth it. Uh... I would do a lot for a uh, four-day week instead of a five-day. I think, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, all right. I, hey, I'm hired. I did it. And also, unrelated, I beat the game. Man. So, that was a thing. That was a hell of a last battle. A bit, I mean, yeah, you gotta get, you gotta get the crystals. It's always about getting the crystals. It took me a little bit to notice. The fact that, was that chunks of the labs were teleported in, and that's how I got a whole bunch of stuff is so good. This was really good! And it was so good that, honestly, original Half-Life 2 is still in the bucket. It's still an option. I still wanted to play the OG and see how the two compare. Not right now, of course. It's something for the future. But it is something in the future that I absolutely 100% want to do. And I'm looking forward to it. See, normally I like to give my thoughts about what I've just done and what I've just played and all that. However, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, most of my mind is in the space of Xen. I feel like that has taken over the Half-Life part of the game. And I think... Uh, so, originally, Black Mesa was released. It was the part that's on Earth. Then there was like a three-year pause, and then there was Xen. And I feel like that is the correct way to play it. Play, play, play the Half-Life remake. Wait. And then play the Zen fan game, quote-unquote. I think that's the correct way, because I feel like the Zen part completely took over. Both in good and in bad, I felt like Zen felt a lot more like a video game than the Earth part. Like, I feel like as much as, like, a game the game is, there's always that extra effort to not make the environment necessarily realistic, but at the very least, you know real enough like like easy enough to just kind of abandon your uh, well like just kind of accept your uh, sense of uh, disbelief basically you know there's just enough verisimilitude that you don't really think about it and it's actually pretty impressive well i felt zen was a lot more video game <laughs> gotta find a flower to pop the leaves at the end of the of the of the of the vine and then later do the same thing, pop the red bottle, then follow the red thing, see where the barrier got removed. And here, there's a place where you gotta do that three times. It's, like, I get it. But I'm still very impressed with that exam, because it is very good. Like, it is, there's, there's, especially the outside part, the outside part is fantastic. It really much feels like you had, like, all these people who played uh, Half-Life when it was new, you know, they got to Zen, and they're like, all right, well, I guess that's Zen. And like, you know, you had all these different peoples who were like, who had a few years, a decade, two decades to kind of think down, think, man, if I had my way, Zen had this part and would have this part and would have this part. And I think they kind of put all that together. And the result is impressive. You can tell the passion. This is a fantastic game. I am extremely happy that I have played. Now I'm- Whoa! There we go! End game! The game has ended. Ugh! Like, yeah, like, uh, so, again, I am extremely unexperienced with first-person, uh, shooters. So I played this game on the easiest difficulty. I think it was the right decision. I had just enough difficulty to like not so that the game wasn't free for me that I had to be a little bit careful. I know it was probably embarrassing for some people watching me play just walk into things and whatnot, but you know, it's me learning a new tool, you know? Um Almost every weapon had their time to shine. Like, of course I had my favorite, but I think I used everyone at least one effectively. Except for the babies whom I kept forgetting existed. Maybe that's one issue I have with the games, that there are too many- I think there are too many weapons. 
Uh, but I think that's a good problem to have if you're gonna have a problem because you know it gives a uh, gives a choice for the player to like express themselves personally through the weapons they choose. Also, that's because I was playing in normal difficulty. I'm sure you have to regiment and be a lot more careful with your weapons and higher difficulty. I feel like that's not what I was interested in. What I was interested in playing the whole game from start to finish was the environment and exploring and navigating the environment, finding the one through path through the environment. I got a feeling that having to manage my ammo and whatnot would have been a distraction I would not care for. So I think I made the right decision, personally super cool there's a ton of value in this game this game's a long game and like i said i played the hardest like it, uh, at the easiest if i was if it's a game i got for myself i could replay at the at the, at the harder levels and then you know then there's the achievements uh yeah there's there is value um i liked it i love it i loved it i played it thank you hydrochloric for putting this game in my eye paths and making me play it Next time, we're, it's kind of funny to say, but we are uh, keeping to the theme of science fiction.